Hey y'all, welcome back to the pink envelope. I have a haul for you today. All of these boxes are Christian owned, Christian supporting subscription boxes. So the Christian subscription box haul. Um, I'm gonna show you these four and then I have three others that I recently opened in other videos that we're gonna mention just so you can pop over there and check those out. But these actually kind of are a mix of just Christian owned or Christian sourced products or a way to support you in your walk with Jesus. And so we'll break down each one of those as we get to it. I wanna start with Faith Box and then we'll go out from there. We have opened Faith Box on the channel before, but it's been a while, like over a year, I believe. So it's really good to bring it back. So here on the box, it literally says, we are a Christian community that helps you stay centered in Christ every month with our amazing devotional, inspired content, and hand-picked products that do good. And I think that's actually, I had written out kind of that same thing, but mine was much longer. I think the only thing I would add is that you get about three to five products that are jewelry, accessories, Christian books, art, decoration, and more. And they pursue partnerships with ethical and eco-friendly products. The box is monthly and they have two different ones. So there's a smaller version called the Faith Pack at $22.95. And then there's this box here, which is $39.95 and they do offer prepaid discounts. Shipping is based on your location, so that will vary, but they ship here in the United States. I forgot to look to see if I have a coupon code. So if I do, I will pop it up right here. Otherwise go down to the description and click on that URL. Uh, they may attach an offer to that URL that isn't necessarily of a devotional uh, ministering to yourself. If you're at a stage of life, whether you have littles or you're caring for an elderly parent that maybe isn't allowing you to go join a Bible study like you would like, you could subscribe to Faith Box and have your Bible study and community brought to you. So when you open your box, you have the link to the private members group, which I was saying the community you would hang with. And then you can also go to their website to get products that add on to this. So this is like your base box of everything you need. But if you are a more is more kind of girl, you can go get some more over there. Um, and then they do have social media if you wanna hang there. So in this top box, I see a bookmark with a quote from Stephen Curtis Chapman. When love takes you in, everything changes. So there's this guy. And then on the back, it talks about the family impact. You can scan that and see what's going there. Here is the devotional. This one's called Everyday Faith for Family, edition eight, number 11. It literally is a sequence that builds upon the previous month. And I mean, I re vaguely remember looking at the last one. So I'm flipping through this one here. It looks pretty easy. It is not the same thing every single day. It looks like it mixes prayer and reading. And then let me flip over here. Quotes and journaling. It does have a good mix. I also love that it's like throwing your handbag. So even if you are someone who is like, I go to Bible study on Tuesday mornings, this would be something I could keep with me on the go instead of having like the weight of an entire big book. I actually really like that. I don't know what this is. It looks like it's made of real wood. Oh, there we go. Thankful, grateful, blessed. It's home decor. <laughs> Ethically made in India. That would be super cute on your desk at work or on a shelf, on a bookshelf. Super, super cute. What is this little guy? He's happy. These unique products are made in Kenya by Creative Alternatives whose artisan use recycled materials ranging from discarded magazines to old martyr and transforms them to create whimsical taka, wait, hold on, how do we say this? Taka Taka Collections. So this actually has a safety pin on the back. So <laughs> did y'all know that it's all the rage to wear pins for the preteen teen crowd? 
They have pins on their backpacks, pins on their lunch boxes, pins on. So this is like the adult version <laughs> of wearing those pins. That's what's going through my mind. Oh, what in the world is this? It's taped close. I'm gonna try to open it gently because I don't want to tear because it looks like it's made of paper. What? Border bites a removable adhesive vinyl with decorative words. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna be able to flatten it out some. I'm gonna drag it. <laughs> hold on against my desk and see if I do it like this. Okay, yeah, I think I got it. I'm trying to get it where it can open up where you guys can see it. So it's a vinyl you could stick it, I'm guessing, on a wall or a window, but it's removable, so it's not gonna do damage. Peel back the vinyl and apply onto smooth, clean surface. No waters or glues needed. Smooth out with hand. Remove and reposition as needed. Not a transfer, not a stencil. Easy on, easy off. Okay, this is really unique and this is really cool. I feel like this is thinking outside the box. So we have the wall window, wherever you want to put it, vinyl. Another quote by Stephen Curtis Chapman, but this one's more of the frameable art setup. And then, oh, we have an advent book. Advent Conspiracy, Making Christmas Meaningful Again. This book alone has a retail value of $18. Very, very cool. So if you are looking for the box, it's going to send cool, ethically made products while also supporting you in your walk with the Lord. Take a look at Faith Box. If this is too much stuff, there is the Faith Pack, which I, let me just peek real quick. The Faith Pack is $22.95 and it comes with the Everyday Faith Devotional, the daily video on that day's devotion that comes in both boxes. The Inspirational Living Book and a set of custom design inspirational art posters to encourage your faith. I'm not sure what that looks like, but I have a feeling that varies based on what you're seeing here. But would fall, I would say, in a category that looks a bit like this. So this would be like the mini version. If you have a friend who is new to faith and is like, I don't even know how to start this Bible study journey, this could be a great gifting option. And then, of course, I always think of people who are just stuck. Why are they stuck at home? Why are they at a stage of life where they can't move? New moms, grandparents. I love, love, love that option for them. So to kind of swing over, let me show you this box. This is brand new to the channel. This is Enjoy Box. So Crate Joy sent me the Faith Box. And Crate Joy sent me the Enjoy box. So I told him I'm working on a subscription box haul of Christian subscription boxes. And they're like, oh, we have boxes for that. And they sent these over for us to share with you guys. And I'm super thankful because I wanted a mix of some OGs that we knew we loved, Faith Box, and some new ones we've never had an opportunity to look at. So this one says, to Samantha from Enjoy, speak hope, show love, and deliver joy. What are our three principles here on the pink envelope? We're looking for subscription boxes that save you time, save you money, and spark joy. So this box is monthly. They actually have four different options starting at $27 in a box. I'm showing you like the big enjoy box for her. This has a value of $48 per month. Shipping's based on your location, and it's a box of encouragements. Enjoy Box makes it easy to deliver joy to yourself or others. Every month, this box features a different Bible verse and includes fun and encouraging items carefully selected to brighten your day. Each box comes with one personalized item with the recipient's name and a handwritten note of encouragement from the team, plus seven to nine fun, encouraging items. Each box is prayed over before it is shipped. So this is what we see on top. This is the November box. I think we're releasing all of these late enough that it shouldn't be a spoiler. Hi, Samantha. All of us at Enjoy Box hope you enjoy your box. We pray that it brightens your day and is a wonderful reminder of how special and loved you are. I love that. 
So here's everything that's inside the box. And then there's a note on the back about a thankful heart and the scriptures that go with it. Um, let's jump back to this. Oh, I see there's a Spotify playlist. We're gonna jump back to this once we have more of the products out. So we have the welcome letter on here that talks about the monthly devotion, how they give back and how to follow. It's very pretty in case you're wondering, this is very neatly packed. Okay, this is separate. What is this? Praise the name of God with a song. Magnify him with thanksgiving. It's a pillowcase, you guys. <laughs> that is super, super cool. So there is a zipper here at the bottom and it is a pillow cover. I love when we get home decor in these different boxes. Obviously, you would set this out for the fall autumn season. It's got a very Thanksgiving vibe to it. Next, we have Heavenly Caramels in Pumpkin Spice. Oh my gosh, these sound so good. I'm a sucker for a caramel, but with all of my weird eating restrictions, it's one of the few things I can actually eat. What is this? You can tell it's a jar. Counting my blessings. And then the jar is wrapped real cute. It has this tag. And then I'm seeing inside, I think little note cards you can write blessings on. Yes. There's a few already pre-cut out cards that you can write different blessings on and then put them back in here so you can look back in a heart of gratitude to see the ways that God has been working in your life. We all need to do that. I, I need to do that. I feel like that has been a huge topic of discussion with Jonathan and I. Not only that we ourselves need to do that, but that we need to train our girls to do that as well. We got some napkins, cool breeze, family, pie, cozy sweater, all the different things that make up being thankful in the fall. What are these guys? They look like a little tiered tray decor. <laughs> I think they are. There's two little pumpkins right here. Decorative use only by Cole House Designs. Two little decorative tiered tray looking guys. Oh, what is this? Is for you. It's wrapped like a gift. Like you have to undo it. Oh my gosh. It's a bracelet set. But it's like folded like a gift. How very, very cute. See? I love it. Very fall inspired. I love when things are very seasonally inspired. So what is this guy? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. A small pedestal tray. So as you can see, it's like literally a pedestal, but it has my name on it. That is super, super cool. Although great ring dish, put that up. Very cute. Seven items that some of them are consumables, some of them are multi-use. We also got the handwritten note, the Spotify playlist, and our thankful heart reminder on the back here. So this box definitely is giving me more of like a Christian lifestyle box where you're receiving affirmations and great reminders of where our focus should be via really cool products. Well, we're off to a very good start. The first two boxes have nothing in common and fulfill two very different spaces. So if you like them both, you could subscribe to both because you would not be getting duplicates. Another one we have opened on here before is Salt and Light Lavender Box. This is like maybe our third or fourth time to open this box. This box smells so good every single time we open it. In fact, some of the first lavender I ever got is on that shelf right there. I don't even know if it still smells good because I've had it over a year, but I put it in a bundle of dried flowers and sat it on the shelf and I, I just love it being there. So it has stayed up there. So let me tell you about Salt and Light. 
This box is bi-monthly, meaning you get one every other month, six across a year. It is $40, shipping $7.95 in the US, and if you use the coupon code PINK5, you get 5% off. And this is a faith-based, small family-owned business. They care for over 550 lavender plants on their farm in Northeast Ohio. And they use those items to create the bundles and essential oils and lavender themed things that we see in the box. They research their own ingredients and their own recipes and hand make everything with pure and clean ingredients to create each of the products that are in here. You're gonna get scripture cards and encouragement for women to make sure you're filling your cup. Each box has four to six self-care items. Um, but this box right here is their extra special box. This could be a spoiler, I'm gonna warn you right now. And it has eight items inside. I don't even have the box all the way open and it smells so, so good. So we have a scripture of hope on the top and then their family in the lavender fields. I think it is so, so cool that they do this. Once again, as you can see, very giftable. This is very pretty. It can be gifted at any point for any season. I'm opening the Christmas one, but this is a year round box. So right, birthdays, uh, baptisms, graduations, and more. So this month's box theme is hope. We see it here. We have it on the brochure here. So we have hope for December. Actually, it says hope, gold, and lavender are the themes. And then inside here, it talks about all the different products. I'm not gonna open it all the way because I want us to be surprised we can bounce back. But let me just show you what this, whoopsies. Let's try it like this. Let me just show you what this looks like here. Isn't that so, so cute? So I'm gonna pull the lavender bundle out because this is exactly what I was talking about that I got in one of my boxes about a year ago that is sitting up on the shelf. And it's just with a stack of other like baby's breath and stuff. It's just so pretty and it smells so, so, so good. And it must be pretty durable because that shelf is where I stack all my boxes that I'm about to open. So it gets knocked around all the time and the lavender still looks great. In this first package, we have a handmade beauty lavender body butter. Oh my gosh. So this is what their containers look like. Let's smell it. This is exciting. Oh my gosh. Lavender. It's like, well, it's made with real lavender, which is why I'm about to say it's the perfect lavender scent. Made with shea butter, coconut oil, olive oil, cocoa butter, lavender essential oils, and turmeric essential oils. Take a small amount and massage into your skin. I love, love, love these type of things. I always want to keep these in this top drawer and then the top drawer will be like overflowing <laughs> from all the things that I love and want to keep at hand. Our second hope package is a lavender clay mask. It says you can leave it on for 20 minutes or until it dries, splash with water to remove. Please be a candle, please be a candle. It is, it is a lavender hand poured candle. And so let me put it like this so you can see what the front looks like. Oh, what is this? Salt and Light Lavender Eyelash Serum. Stop, I didn't even know this existed. Made with ingredients inspired by nature, castor oil, fraction coconut oil, vitamin E, lavender and rosemary essential oils apply every night before bed to lashes okay so i want to start wearing more fake lashes for dressing up and doing fun things i've been getting them in two of my boxes my lurella has been sending the most of them my beauty subscription boxes but i've been nervous to do it without some kind of something for my lashes this might be the exact thing i need so in the evenings once i take them off i start building back up my natural lash line because i don't want to lose my natural lashes i'm going to try that oh this has a pretty wood lid what is this guy a lavender in floral salt it's a bath soak this is so pretty, I don't even wanna use it. I just wanna leave it like this with this wood lid and have it on display. But it does say you can soak for 20 to 30 minutes. 
I'm over here decorating with my box. <laughs> The Sultan Light Lavender Hair Oil. Oh my gosh, I use hair oil on the regular. I <laughs> use it because I don't uh, wash my hair as frequently as I should. I probably should wash my hair twice a week. I definitely only wash it once a week. So about day four or five, I will put this oil on my scalp because it starts to dry out so bad. I know you girls with straight hair are freaking out that I'm intentionally adding oil to my hair, but some of us, our hair is equivalent to straw. It's just the way it is. So, and then I'll rub this out and pull it through my hair to give it shine and it makes it last the last little bit. Super stoked to use this. Once again, I had obviously the lotions and the scrubs I've heard of and the candle I've heard of and the bundles I've heard of. I've never had a hair oil or a lash serum and I think that is super cool. And then last but not least, what is this? Is this a bar of soap? I'm guessing. Yes, a lavender turmeric goat milk soap. And there's that guy there. So what did I say this was? I know this is a box that has more products than normal. Normally they have four to six, this one has eight. Oh my gosh, $40. This is only $40. If we went into a store, we would spend $40 on this. If we're, if we're lucky, we may be able to get those three for 40, but there's no, there's no way, there's no way you could get all this. So this is a crazy, crazy good value. And then in here, it says to use this bag for your soak. Like you can put these items in the bag and drop it in the water so that it doesn't go everywhere. And then it breaks down every single product that's in here, what it's made of, how it's used. And then they break down here why they chose these three things in what they mean in the scriptures and to us in the creation of these products. So, whoa, <laughs> you could get all three boxes I've shown you right now and not have really any overlap because one is a self-care, one is a lifestyle, and one is a Bible study. Well, this next box is going to fit in really, really well. So this box is Artsa, also not new to the channel. We've opened them a few times. Arts is a quarterly subscription, meaning it comes four times a year. It's $94.99, but they do offer prepaid discounts. Shipping is based on your location, and if you use code PINK20, you get 20% off your first box. And all of the products are small local businesses and charities that you are directly helping to support with each box purchased. Each box comes from a different city in Israel with a goal of bringing text and stories within the Bible to life. This is a perfect gift for anyone of any age. It's filled with artisanal gifts and is easy to share. So I haven't dove into this with each of the boxes, but every single box I've shown you has a ministry that they give back to full time. So I didn't have anybody in the hall who, which I actually don't think I encountered any of the Christian subscription boxes that didn't give back. But I did want to say, I read it about arts and then realized I didn't emphasize that all of them do a great job of giving back. So this could be a spoiler. This is the seven species, box number 13. When you open the box, this is what it looks like. On top, you always have this guy here, which is like your card to let you know what's gonna be happening here in the box. Just a really great overview. But where you really get all of the information about the box is within these guys right here. These cards are super nice. <laughs> <laughs> like that's technically a frameable art. I'm just saying it's gorgeous. And this one's actually a postcard as well. That's why it's so pretty. And then we have a recipe, the crispy chicken schnitzel. Oh my gosh. That sounds so, so good. These cards are cool because they do a myriad of things. So this is learning Hebrew. They give you a picture the English word, the Hebrew word, and how to pronounce it. Sometimes I can do good with these, but honestly, sometimes I have to grab my cell phone and have them said out loud before I can actually say them. But I love that they do this. And then on here is the breakdown of everything that is in the box with more information about the people who created each of the items. And then there is a card for each person what they created, and then on the other side, it talks about their story, why they're creating it, how they created it. And there is one for all the products that are in the box here. 
So speaking of products, let me show you what you typically get in a box. They do a good job of sending a mix of consumables and reusables. So for instance, look at this guy here. Season breadcrumbs for your schnitzel recipe. Ah, oh, it makes me so mad that I am gluten-free and will not be able to dive into this because I bet this is beyond delicious. It is made by a company or a family, should I say, in Bethlehem of Galilee. That is super, super, super cool. Uh, I have a friend who loves to cook. He loves to cook. So I'm gonna bring this as a hostess gift next time we're at his house. He's always making us wildly good dinner. So that's what I'll do with that. He's also a pastor at our church, so it will have dual meaning. He will love it. Okay, what is this? Date spread. Ooh, this one is all me, baby. Ready for a charcuterie. <laughs> I love cheeses and jams together. That sounds delightful. And then what are these? Are these olives? Please say yes. My daughter's going to be so excited. They are olives of love, crushed green olives. We literally went to the store on Sunday and had her get one of those trays and put one of each type of olive from the olive bar in so that she can try and rate her favorite olive down to her least favorite olive. And most all the ones she loves were this color, a green, or the lighter shade of black. I don't know if there's a difference. I don't eat olives, but she loves them. We can put this on the charcuterie and she can dive in. Well, this is gorgeous. A gentle cleansing face mousse in lavender and rose. Oh yeah, it's got a foam pump. Apply mousse to clean neck and face. Rub with your fingertips until absorbed. Oh wait. Apply mousse to clean neck and face, then use your fingertips, lightly rub in mousse until absorbed. You don't rinse it off. That's really cool. I may try that. I typically don't bake, break my face routine, but I'm intrigued by that guy. And then here is a fig candle made in Israel. Of course, all of it is. Oh, very cool. I'm gonna put my finger on it so it doesn't fall forward. A beeswax candle made from 100% beeswax in cotton wicks. Come on. So it has <laughs> the wick on top and it's just literally a beeswax candle. It smells like beeswax. <laughs> That's great. And I mean, I don't have the time, but there's stories like on the side here, like the casting, how it was made, why it was made, what it means. I don't have time to dive into all of this, but it's more than just a product. You also can come back and get the product card about the person who made it and read why they made it, what inspired them, what they prayed over while they were creating these items. It's super cool. There's still several more items in here, just so y'all will know. This says, a land of wheat and barley and vines and figs and pomegranates, a land of olive trees and honey. Is it art? Oh yeah, it's definitely art. It looks like, I, so hold on, I need to look at it like this. Yes, it goes like this. It's like cut out paper. Then, but there's a backing, it has a 3D element to it. It does have a hanger on the top here. And then on here is a whole story, plus there is a card from the designer who made this. It talks about all of why, what the meaning is, what each of these symbols mean, what the words say. Wish we had more time, y'all. Hey, you kept saying I'm gonna make myself a charcuterie. I got myself a cute charcuterie board. This is really cool and it's plastic. I love the, the color tones in this. Very fall and gorgeous. There's still more. These boxes always have so much inside. Okay, let me pull ooh, this out. It's glass. It looks like it's a trivet, one that you can either uh, serve on or put on display. Yeah. Okay, I'm not gonna break it. Now I'm confident that I have it out and I'm touching it. It's actually a trivet that holds hot dishes. It goes in your kitchen. So actually, it should probably go like that. And it does have feet on the bottom, so it sets up. So we've got 
food, serving, home decor. I could go with home decor, but also this could go with home decor as well. It's a good mix of things. And wait, four times a year, you don't get too much stuff. You're able to walk through the process of everything and learn and experience. And there's videos, their website has so much on it. So go down to their website if you wanna take a peek as well. And you can really immerse yourself in everything through these cards here where there's QR codes you can scan and then hop on their website and hang out with them. Another great one, Arza. And then there were two other boxes that I was hoping was gonna make it here for this video, but they are still shipping and I needed to get this out. Um, so I'll subscribe to the channel and I'll throw them in one of the halls, either one of our mini halls or I'll throw it into the December monthly hall, which will be coming up next. And so if you subscribe, you won't miss that. So boxes I wanted to mention that are owned by Christian women and literally as they're packing the boxes and shipping them out, they're praying over these boxes um, are the next few I want to share with you. I just released videos on them. So opening those boxes again in this video felt redundant. But the first one I want to talk about is somewhat new to the channel. She just released her second box. It's Evergreen Lane. And in that first video, I'm going to link the first video right here. And in that first video, we talked pretty in depth about what she was designing, creating, because they're, they're Amish made and American made products. So a lot of the products are made by the woman who owns the box. She curates and hand pours and paints and all the things, those items that go in the box. And so we talked about a lot of what the inspiration was in that first box. Uh, but the second unboxing, the one I just released, I'm gonna link right here. It's only been out maybe a week, so I don't think it's sold out yet. Um, if it has, just go to her website and subscribe for the next box. It is a quarterly box, so only four times a year. It is a home decor subscription box. And so it's $250 and I do have a coupon. Um, that is attached to the URL below. So if you just click on that URL, it'll shoot you over and you'll get a free item in your box. So that is a Christian owned company that I highly, highly recommend. The second one I wanna share with you is also brand new to the channel. She just shared her first box. She shared her first box with me and then she was like, I'll have to get back with you. I'm going to Houston as a fundraiser in a ministry she's a part of. So we got to talk about that. So I really got to hear more of her testimony there. It's simply hosted. It is a entertainers and hostess subscription box. It's also quarterly. It's $249, but she's offering a really great uh, discount up until December 1st. So if you're watching this right out the gate, you're gonna have time to grab that. Otherwise, that coupon will have slipped by. But Pink 10 will get you 10% off your box no matter what. But if you want to go down below, you can get an additional 10% off an annual all four boxes uh, by going and watching this video here. So information is down below. I do have a full dedicated unboxing about Simply Hosted you can check out. And then lastly, I wanna talk about a box that's been around well over a year, Free Spirit Bundle, also owned by a Christian family, Christian woman who curates it, who prays over the items, prays over the boxes, and actually has prayed with her subscribers when they've reached out to her during a time of trial. So she is another one I highly recommend. Also quarterly, it is a home decor subscription box. She has two box options. The Petite is $139.99 and the Elite is $169.99. And you can use coupon code pink envelope to receive a bonus item in your first box, free shipping. You can check out her last unboxing, which is this one here. Um, as the time of posting this video, you can still get your hands on that November bundle, but there's only a few left. Uh, there's a couple of the Elite and there's a couple of the Petite. So if you go there and that one is sold out, just sign up for the next one. The coupon code will still work. So I'm sure there's more out there. Uh, these are just the ones that came to mind when I was curating this, praying over this video, sourcing boxes. Crystal was helping me. Crate Joy was helping me. I just really wanted to bring a good variety. Uh, it, but there's still so much more. There's some Christian t-shirt companies I didn't get my hands on in time. There's the two boxes that are in the mail right now. I'm not gonna tell you too much about them, but they're really cool. Christian owned, Christian supporting companies. And so we'll just see, this is part one. Maybe we'll be able to do a Christian subscription box haul part two. If you have any questions about these boxes, you can drop them down below. If you wanna talk in private, we have the private Ask the Pink Envelope Facebook group. You can head over there and you can chat with us. We're a group of mostly ladies um, and everybody is simply, simply wonderful.
I hope that you guys are having an absolutely blessed day. I will be praying over each and every comment I see below. Feel free to message me in private if you want me to pray over something specifically. And if you subscribe to my channel, I'm going to see you guys later. Bye, y'all.